I should do an intro. I was just gonna go launch straight into California mottos. Good morning from sunny Barstow. We're walking to get breakfast at Roy's. Roy's Cafe. And we are spotting cool neon signs. None of them are lit up except for ours. We stayed in a fun place called the Route 66 Motel last night. Which has round beds, although we did not get round beds. What was our California motto from yesterday? California, something about worries. Oh yeah, the place to worry. The place to worry. Oh, here we are. Yeah. Cafe. Here's the cool view off into California. Today we are driving from Barstow to the end of the trail, which is Santa Monica. It's a great town name. And then we're gonna go up Highway One to Santa Barbara, and we had a good breakfast. Roy's Cafe serves good coffee. Serves good coffee mugs. How are you feeling today, Janet? Oh. <laughs> How are you feeling today, Bo? Bo seemed very grumpy earlier. He is an old Southern gentleman. Recovering from his appearance yesterday at the restaurant. Mm, yeah. Social engagements really take it out of him. Because quantum physics was just spinning up at that time, and so he thought that quantum physics was about like the overlapping of our world and like the satanic world. And so he literally did like black magic rituals in his basement trying to summon Satan with spooky quantum physics. Uh -huh. How was he involved with forming JPL? He was one of the founding members of JPL. He oh. and one of his colleagues from Caltech were some of the like big ideas behind rocket propulsion of their time. That's why it's uh -huh. called Jet Propulsion Labs. They would do crazy stuff like launch homemade rockets in like the valley next door. And he was also famously BFFs with L. Ron Hubbard. And then L. Ron Hubbard ran away with his wife. And L. Ron Hubbard and his wife like stole his yacht and ran off together. And he did some like spooky dark magic. And there was a big storm that night apparently. And then JPL was like, okay, sir, you can go now. And so he ended up being someone who made custom pyrotechnics for Hollywood for a while until his whole apartment slash house crumbled on top of him for like a kind of unknown reason. So JPL was founded by a witch. Huh. Half, half founded by a witch. The more you know. Ooh, El Cowboy. San Bernardino. Here we are. We made it to the last stop on the song. I think that what he's saying is that society is harsh and cruel and full of lies. But Paul McCartney and his monkey are untouched by that. And they remain naive mm. and true. And they have nothing to hide. Is that why their outside is in and their inside is out? Maybe. Actually, that was a pretty good interpretation. I should write for Rap Genius. You should contact Quack. He got fired for Rap Genius, didn't he? I think I so. just can't go on the vlog. We can bleep out his name. <laughs> With quacks. Quack. I'll use that sound bite. We are in the valley. Look at these beautiful mountains that we're driving. Oh, is that why it's called the valley? So if it's in a valley? That would make sense. That is how valleys work. To our left, we are going to pass Vince's sp spaghetti. That was Vince's spaghetti. There's the magic lamp. It's Here's the giant open. alert. Magic lamp. Careful. It's fine. I'm a great vlogger. Giant alert number two. Euclid and Foothill is the Madonna of the Trail statue, depicting a rugged pioneer mother and children, one of 12 across the country. Albuquerque also has one. Hmm. Honoring those sturdy women who had to listen to months of how much longer and when will we be there. Thank you, Jerry, for your boomer jokes. <laughs> From the back seat of the covered wagon. Oh boy. That was like double boomer. It's very exciting that we like know the person who wrote yeah. this guidebook, who's writing us all this advice. Yeah. So casual. <laughs> 